As the investigation continues into a weekend crash that claimed the life of a former YSU football player, the community continues to remember him. Hundreds came out to a memorial put on by the Youngstown State Athletic Department for 24 year old Darius Shackelford. I was at Stambaugh Stadium tonight where those who know him tell me Darius was truly irreplaceable. As a coach, if you had a, a whole team full of Darius Shackelford, you'd, you'd feel pretty good. The day he stepped on the earth, he was a bright light and he shined as bright as he possibly could. Hundreds gathering tonight to honor the short life of former YSU football player Darius Shackelford. You would never think it's going to happen to you and then it, it happens to you and you just like, you don't know, like if what's real, you know, is up down, you know, like it's, it's it, your whole frame is just rocked. He was just the ultimate team player and I mean, you see the kind of uh, reception he had out here today. I mean, what everyone thought of him, he was just uh, a great kid to be around. Friends and family remembering Darius for his humble and loving personality. The most important legacy he'll leave is just to treat people the right way because that's that was him, you know. He would make everybody feel good, whoever he was around. He made you feel like his your problems was his problems, you know, and he helped with he helped you work through whatever you were going through. Family telling me he loved his team, alma mater, and the game of football. He had a lot of options and he weighed those options very carefully and this is this is where he settled, so he knew that this was the place for him to be. You can try to make sense of why you lose somebody like him at such a young age, but you know you, you have faith that he's a, he's in a better place right now and he's up in heaven. Darius just graduated in December from YSU. Funeral services have yet to be announced. The crash that claimed his life remains under investigation. Officials say 19-year-old was fleeing from police when he crashed into, into Darius's car last Saturday.